Hi guys, this is Megha Verma. Welcome to my channel. So in today's tutorial, we will learn how to design this book cover in Corel Draw. So without any delay, let's get started. So this is the size of our book cover, six by nine. So first we will select the rectangle tool from the toolbar and we will draw a rectangle. Now we will set the size of the rectangle 6 by 9. Now we will go to align and distribute and we will set the align. First we will click on specified point then we will align horizontally and vertically. Now we will make a copy by drag and right click. Now we will import one image. Now we will decrease the size of the image. Now we will adjust the size according to our book cover size. Now we will right click on the image and now we will click on option power clip inside. Now we will click on the rectangle. Now we will click on add it. Now we will place image according to the rectangle. We will adjust the size of the image. Now we will click on finish. So this is our front cover of the book. Now we will make one more copy of the rectangle. Now we will select the rectangle and the front cover. Now we will set the align. First we will click on selected object. Now we will align horizontally and vertically. Now we'll fill color in the rectangle. Now we'll remove the outline by right click. Now we will decrease the height of the rectangle. Now we'll right click on the rectangle and we will select option convert to curves. Now we'll select the shape tool. And we will select the node and right click then delete. Now we'll click on the line. We will click on convert to curve. Now we will drag the handles. We will make a shape like this. Now we we'll select the transparency tool from the toolbar and we will the size of the transparency. Now we'll select the text tool from the toolbar and we will write a text. Now we will write the name of the book. Now we'll select the interactive fill tool from the toolbar and we will apply on the text. Now we will set the colors of the interactive fill tool. You can see the color codes which I am using in the text. front cover. Now we will adjust the size. Again we will select the text tool and we will write text. Now we will increase
increase the size of the text. I'll go to the edit menu. Now I'll select the option copy properties from. Now I'll tick on fill and then OK. Now I'll click on from where we want to copy the properties. Now I'll select both text and we will set the align horizontally. Again we will write text. Select the font style. a bold look to this text now we will write the writer name changing the font style of the writer name Now we will make a back cover of the book, front side of our book is ready. So now we will work on the back cover. Now first we will fill color in the rectangle and we will remove the outline. Now we select the text tool and we will write the book name. Now we will give bold look to the text. Now I will copy the text to write a paragraph text. Now we will select the text tool and we will make a selection to write a paragraph text. Now paste. Now select all the text and we will increase the size. Now we will click on horizontally alignment. Now we will click on full justify. 
now we will drag and make a copy by right click of the paragraph Now we will select the rectangle tool from the toolbar and we will draw a small rectangle. Now we will fill white color in this rectangle and we will remove the outline. Now we will select the rectangle and the big rectangle and we will align from the left. Now we will decrease the size. Now again I will copy the text. Now I will paste. Now we will adjust the size according to the rectangle. we will give a bold look to the text now again we will make one more copy of the paragraph text and we will reduce the width of this this paragraph Now we will import barcode and we will place on the back cover. Now we will select all and we will move. Now we will right click and then group. So guys our book cover is ready. I hope you like the design. If you have any questions regarding this tutorial you can ask me on the comment box. Please like share and comments. And if you are new to my channel please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.